Hi, I have Dr. Campanelli from Midwest Facial Plastic Surgery with me today, and we are going to be discussing the latest in aesthetic injectables. Hi, Dr. Campanelli. Hi, Emily. It's uh, good to be here. So I've been hearing a lot lately about Lviv. What can you tell me about it? Sure. Um, so Lviv is an uh, FDA-approved process by which we take a patient's own fibroblasts, we grow them in the lab, and then we're able to actually inject them back to get an aesthetic improvement. And what are fibroblasts? So fibroblasts are the cells that are in your skin that make collagen. Collagen is what is lost as we get older that takes away all of that nice uh, firm support that we have to the skin. How does the process work? So a patient will come into our office, a biopsy will be taken, and that biopsy is sent to the lab. Once it's at the lab, those fibroblasts will be extracted, they'll be grown, and once we have sufficient numbers of them, they're placed in the syringe sent back to the lab where they're re-injected. You mentioned a skin biopsy. Can you tell me a little more about that? Sure. So the skin biopsy is taken from behind the ear where it's really not noticeable at all. There's very little discomfort involved and the process is very quick. So after the injections, will I see an immediate improvement? No. With Lviv, the fibroblasts take about three months to grow. And once they're uh, grown, they're sent back, we inject them, it takes about another three months before a sufficient collagen is formed, so you'll see an aesthetic improvement. So the whole process takes about six months. Dr. Campanelli, how is Lviv different from other fillers? Lviv is 100% natural. It's your own cells which are giving you the cosmetic improvement. And once I have the treatment, how long do the results last? Well, that's a good question. Uh, Lviv was just approved, and so we really don't have long-term results. Those studies are ongoing right now. What we do know is that collagen, once it's made, has a lifespan of about 10 to 15 years. So will I have to do the treatment all over again? No. So when we have those fibroblasts in the lab, we can actually uh, cryopreserve or freeze them. And when you need more fibroblasts, we can just grow more and um, re-inject them. Are there any side effects with the treatment? As with any procedure, there are risks involved. The main risk with Lviv is that you'll get a bruise from the injection. And how many syringes are typical with Lviv? So with the treatment, you get six actual syringes of fibroblasts that come. And then after that, then uh, you can purchase additional ones if you like. Well, this sounds really exciting. Thank you so much for telling me more about this today. It was my pleasure.